Well, good morning boys and girls. Um, I'm, uh, I'm out on the beach again as usual. Uh, my favourite place. Uh, this is a new bit of beach that I'm going to uh, search today and uh, yeah we'll see what happens. We're going to go along along the coastline here and uh, the tide is on its way out currently but it's not going a whole long way out so, uh, so there's not a lot for me to do at this uh, this section of beach but we'll give it a shot anyway and we'll see what turns up um, and I'll come back to you on the first hit bye for now well there's find number one <laughs> of absolutely zero significance I've no idea what that was it looks like it's had a bash there and it looks like it was flat Well, we'll take it. We'll have a nosy at home. Alright, back soon. Well, here we go again. There's my first lead fishing weight of the day. Yeah, well. Yeah, well, we'll, we'll take it with us. <laughs> it's absolutely filthy. So all this black mud that's here. Ugh. Oh my god. <laughs> um, in other news, boys and girls, I've uh, I've decided to set up a Patreon. Um, there's three tiers in there. Uh, if you go onto Patreon and look up the Yorkshire Digger, then uh, you'll see my Patreon. And if you want to, it's entirely up to you. Nobody is nobody has to do anything. Um, all my videos will still stay stay the same. Um, but if you feel like donating then it gives you an option to donate so um, so yeah so there you go check it out well there you go boys and girls there's another one oh good old fishing light weight lead <coughs> a couple of barnacles on it there as well <laughs> okay well there you go uh, I'll be honest with you it's not that exciting I know boys and girls but uh, but that's the reality of uh, of beach detecting and metal detecting full stop 90% of the time it's an absolute load of junk but uh, yeah we'll carry on well there you go boys and girls <laughs> sick by magic <coughs> Look, my uh, detector is broken the uh, the plastic from the uh... right I'm going to see if I can glue that back on now oh for god's sake Right, that'll be a job for when I get home anyway, so I'll shove that in my pocket. Alright, on we go. Well, boys and girls, that's the next find, and that is a piece of leaded glass from a stained glass window. How cool is that? Bit of red there, yellow there, and some clear glass there. Cool, I'll hang on to that. Take it with us. And the next find, we found one of these before, and that, boys and girls, is a picture hanger for a dado rail in an old house. So it literally would have sat on the, the wooden rail and you would have hung your picture from it. Had one of those before, so that's why I know what that is. Cool, on we go. Well, <laughs> I've just found my first coin. Let's see what this is. I bet you it's a 2p. I bet you. What on earth is it? Let me get my cloth here. Ooh. I rinse it off in that mucky water. And I'm certain it's a 2 pence. Yeah, it's a 2p. Yeah, well, a coin's a coin. And we go. And I've noticed where that first part's broken, right on the opposite side it's broken as well. On my uh, on my coil. So we might be limited today as to how far we can go. Right, we'll carry on for a wee while, I'll just have to be really careful. Well, that's the next one, and it's a coin. Although it's a very very mucky, dirty coin. Queen Elizabeth on one side, so it's probably a two pence that's gone really crusty and manky and horrible and typical. Thank you very much. <coughs> Let's see if I can just rinse it off in the sea here. 
<coughs> yeah, it's all swollen and crusted up. Yeah, Queen Elizabeth on one side, you can't see her now. But, all monkey on the other, so it's a 2p. Oh yeah, well, on we go. Well, there you go boys and girls. How about that for a bit of... Uh, anybody fancy a bit of urban exploration inside there? <laughs> <laughs> the wall that leading to it is looking rather precarious. Lots of cracks in the wall up there, so... Uh, so no, I think I will give that a miss. I, I'm not for going inside there. <laughs> All right, back soon. Well, it's interesting. There's a new build up there, and uh, what they've done is they've just chopped down all the trees that were surrounding it so they could have a view. Huh? I mean, granted, it's a it's a fairly good view, but really chopping down trees for ah, well, how the rich live, eh? Well, I'm along at, uh, at Rue out near the pier here where I normally find fishing weights and there you go, that looks like a, a really a really random homemade fishing weight, doesn't it? It's literally just a piece of scrap lead with a hole punched in it. Okay. Well, I'm making my way home now, so uh, so if I don't get anything else, I'll see you on the roundup. Um, just to let you uh, boys and girls know as well, I've... Uh, I've started up a second YouTube channel, and it's called, <laughs> rather originally, <laughs> The Yorkshire Digger 2. <laughs> so, um, I'm not sure where I'm going with that second channel at the moment. Um, there's a couple of videos on there, feel free to go and have a nosy. Um, one of them you'll see this, uh, this gorgeous new jacket that I've purchased. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know where it's going exactly. But... Um, I'm thinking along the lines of we might do some outdoorsy type stuff, um, things like uh, lighting fires and cooking, cooking on fires, and maybe some overnight camping, maybe during the summer. So, uh, but we're, I've yet to figure it all out. So, uh, but feel free to to drop by and have a nosy at that second channel if you want to, and uh, I'll see you soon. Well, there we have it. That's me. Uh, that's me home now, boys and girls, and. Uh, that was, I went out just after 9am uh, and it's now a quarter past 12. Uh, that's three hours, three hours walking and searching. So anyway, let me pop, pop the camera on close up and we'll have a look at uh, what little we've got here, but uh, hey, you know, a hunt's a hunt. So this was uh, one of the first things that I found, this little lump of, I don't know if it's brass or not. So it looks like it's had a bit of a bash there. I don't know whether that's from just rolling around in the surf and against the rocks and stuff, but, uh, but hey, no idea. Which is always good. <laughs> Maybe somebody does know that sees this, but uh, uh, let's have a look. Uh, let's go through the lead. And we've got the uh, the handmade one there, which is literally just a, a scrap of lead. Excuse the, uh, the facility guys cutting the grass at the moment, but, uh, but yeah, hole punched in it there. Simple, simple fishing way. Uh, one of these little, uh, I don't even know what you call a sinker. And the big one that we got. And this one, I didn't show you this one, but uh, it's quite an old one, is this one, I think. Still got the loop in the top there. So there's that. And we got the. Uh, the picture hanger. There we go. And that would have hung on a on what they call a dado rail, which is a which is a rail that goes sort of three quarters up the wall around a an old house and a wooden rail. And these would just hang over the top, and then you'd hang your picture on the little bit at the bottom. So they're quite cool. Uh, you can actually still buy those today as well. Coins. Um, Good old two peas. Yeah, who's going to argue with a two p? Eh? <coughs> that one and the second one, which was the crusty one, which is uh, this one's for the bin, I'm afraid. All crusted up and uh, it was all bubbled on one side. There's uh, Queen Elizabeth the second. 
So that one's for the bin, I'm afraid, because that will break the machine at the bank. Last but not least is this lovely little bit of uh, stained glass. And I think that that's come from um, probably the top of a window, sort of like a, a top section. They used to have a, hang on, let me put the camera back to normal here. Uh, so back in the day, you would have had a window like this, but at the top, you would have had a, a separate section, like a, this would be a separate section of glass at the top here, and then like a wood frame going through. Okay, going through there, and then the glass at the top. And I think that's what this, uh, well, both me and the wife currently think that that's what this was. Uh, and it's, like I say, it's maybe like a little sunburst, or maybe a flower of some description. Uh, don't know if you can see it. I'll give it a clean up and we'll have a quick look. Yeah, so I've just given it a clean up there and um, I don't know if you can see, maybe you can't see the colour of this this one here, this piece. It's like a, a reddy brownie colour. There we go, there we go. There we go. And it's actually got like a, a pattern on the glass as well, like a bark effect. There you go, you see that. Um, so, yeah, uh, what that's come from and where it's come from is anybody's guess. But it's a pretty little thing and I, I just couldn't leave it. There we go. Certainly some age to it, I think. So, uh, so yeah, there you go, boys and girls. That was, uh, that was a, bit, a bit of a day out. No. Nothing spectacular found today, but that's the way it goes sometimes. <laughs> that's the way it seems to go for me most of the time. I've, I mean, as you've seen from uh, past videos, I've had some fantastic finds, so you can't complain really. Um, yeah, I've got to, um, I've got to repair, well, see if I can repair or try and get my uh, coil replaced on my metal detector because uh, both the lugs have broken on both sides where it holds onto the shaft or where it screws onto the shaft. So. Uh, so yeah, so uh, I'll have to try and sort that out. Um, and yeah, like I say, uh, I've started a, a Patreon or Patron or whatever, however you pronounce it. Um, I'll put a link in the description below so you can have a look if you want to. You don't have to, totally everybody's own personal choice whether they want to or not. Uh, videos will stay the same. Um, so, uh, so yeah, um, there you go. Uh, remember if, uh, if you like my videos, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you're not a fan, give it a thumbs down because uh, we love those. And, um, and yeah, I'll see you on the next one. All right, bye for now.